Welcome back to Grizz Vision here. I know you Grizzlies.com. My name is Neil Rule. We're here with Coach Campy and Coach. You were home for a minute. Now it's time back on the road at Ohio. I am, but what I really want to do is I want to show people the new wall in my office. So I'm going to move a couple things, and you pan out and show this wall, okay? Because how cool is this? My admin, Sarah Judd, designed this, and they had it put in. And as you can see, it's kind of a... Uh, everybody on here has got a championship ring. we got Pierre Dukes a shot. Jason Rosicki, who has made probably four or five game-winning clutch shots. Of course, Keto Benson. Then you've got Will Hudson, Courtney Scott, JJ, Sean Hopes, Reggie, and then way down at the end is John or Dan Champagne. Now, the cool thing about this is when a recruit comes into our office and sits in with our parents and we tell them about the schedule we play, we don't have to tell them. We can say, look, because... You know, there's Kalen Lucas from Michigan State, Texas, North Carolina, UCLA, Alabama, and then out to the other wall, you got Syracuse and all the other teams that we've played. So it's been pretty it's a pretty cool deal here. Um, so as you can see, it's out here as we walk out. It's a mess out here, yes, but that's okay. People can see it. Let me shut this door real quick. It is a mess out here. Derek there's Nelson. Derek, yeah. There's Derek Nelson, Tennessee, then our team, and a little bit about our, our creed, the last sentence of our creeds on the wall, and then Will Hudson dunking at Syracuse, and then the wall up there, you know, shows the three NCAA tournament bids, the college insider bid, and of course James is going to walk right into the middle of our video. But that's okay, James, come on. And then the Summit League champions. So that's pretty cool, huh? So... I thank her for doing that. Uh, my office is almost complete. We've redone the whole thing. It's still messy. And I'm jumping the gun showing all this probably, but I kind of like it, so why not? All right, so what was your question? It was good to be home for a minute. Now it's back on the road to Ohio speaking of tough opponents. Sweet 16 team with everybody back. All five starters back. The only guy missing is their coach. They got a new coach, and they're off to a 6-2 and two start. They look, they've... Uh, won their first six games at home, and they've lost two road games. They got beat by Memphis, I think, Wednesday night. Um, so, I mean, they beat Michigan in the NCAA tournament last year, and I can't remember who else they beat, but uh, they lost to Carolina in the Sweet 16 game. So uh, they got the great guard in D.J. Cooper, who, you know, we beat them two years ago at their place last year. They beat us at our place by two. Uh, we had a shot at the buzzer, and it didn't go in, and... Um, it's been a good series playing them, so I'm looking for another exciting game tomorrow. It's going to be a difficult, difficult task for us to go in there and get a win, but we're going to do our best. And when you look at Ohio, too, the, the high ranking in the mid-major poll, I mean, they're literally, and we talk about this every year, and, and you've said it yourself, the schedule, and it always comes back to that. I mean, there literally is just no breaks in this. Western uh, last weekend at Ohio this weekend, the MAC. Obviously, we, we saw what Ohio did in the NCAA tournament beat Michigan. Well, and last night, Rochester College, that's that's the best Rochester College team maybe ever. I mean, I, I don't know. They they had a team 20-some years ago. It was unbelievable. But in the you know this modern era, I guess, they, they're a really good team. They've beaten a Division I team. And um, as you saw last night, we really played a good basketball game and had a fairly comfortable win, Which, but it didn't come easy. Yeah, that's for sure, Coach. So what's the biggest key when, when you play the Ohio team? What kind of tempo are you guys looking at? Where do you guys want to play this game at? Well, we've decided that, you know, we, we tried to fool around with tempo a little bit against some of the big boys, and, and I think it kind of blew up in our face. It worked at Pittsburgh, and then we thought it would work again. Well, maybe it did work at Michigan State because we were right there with four minutes to go too. Uh, but Tennessee, it blew up in our face. So, um you know, it's it's time of the year that we got to start preparing for that first league game, which is right around the corner. And we've got to continue to push tempo. We're a much better team when we're running, and uh, we saw that last night. You know, we we didn't really shoot the ball extremely well early, missed a bunch of free throws, yet we still were able to put up close to 90 points. So, um, I like I like coaching a fast tempo. Our, our players like playing it. That's when we're at our best. So, we're just going to go down there and play. And I think Ohio likes that. the game last year was 85, 83, or something numbers like that. So. Uh, I think they'll like to play that. I think you're going to see a high-scoring game, a lot, game with a lot of fun, and maybe we can steal it at the end.
All right, Coach. Appreciate the time. We'll see you on the bus. Okay.